Indonesia is receiving a little bit of a, a dual support at this stage, not just uh, because of low inflation, but I think they're benefiting as well from high commodity prices. And as a result of that, we've seen record uh, trade surpluses coming through. Uh, and at the same time, they managed to pass the uh, the tax reforms earlier than expected in, in early October. So I think that's helping boost uh, sentiment, particularly in, in bond markets. Uh, and so as a result, we have a relatively uh, stable uh, currency and, and BI has been able to sort of uh, continuing uh, to focus on, on the recovery and, and supporting it. And hence, I think they will probably stay patient uh, uh, for, a, for, a, for a prolonged period. Okay, you guys have upped your inflation target, right, for Indonesia for next year uh, to 3%. But that, that's still manageable. Yeah, that's still the midpoint of the, the, the BI's target of 2 to 4%. Uh, but if you look at the trajectory, uh, I would focus uh, on how fast it could go up. And, and I think, um, you know, it's low now. It's uh, below 2%. But uh, by the time we get to April, when they implement the VAT hikes, um, I think that's when you start to see inflation picking up. Uh, and at the same time, domestic demand starts to uh, normalize a little bit. Hopefully they're kind of... Uh, moved away from, um, you know, re recurring lockdowns and, and uh, virus insurgencies. Uh, at that point, we'll probably see inflation uh, picking up towards the top end of the band, which is uh, 4%. And, and to me, that's where BI needs to be a bit more careful and starts to think about uh, hiking rates and normalizing. Do you see that happening around about, I don't know, middle of next year? Probably the back end of 2022. So, wow. like I said, inflation picks up uh, closer to 4%, um, you know, maybe in Q3. Um, but uh, they will not be in a rush to, to hike at that point because, like I said, they, they still want to see growth and the recovery a bit more uh, entrenched. Um, so I think the, the hikes will happen in Q3 and then in Q4, but only fairly modestly. So we are expecting a total of 50 basis points in rate hikes over that, that period, uh, which, you know, uh, in, in normal periods, this is a, a very slow uh, hiking cycle for BI.